struggling to get the right sound from your speakers well i know most of you who have got bookshelf or floor standing speakers have got one common complaint and the complaint is about how the speaker's bass is actually disturbing the mid and the vocals of the speaker now if that is a problem for you i have got a solution as well and the second problem is for the people who have got subwoofers which are going loud enough where they are causing troubles to your neighbors and they are knocking on your doors asking you to lower the volumes or to lower the vibrations now these vibrations i know are very very hard to control but i have got a brand right in front of me called iso acoustics which by the name of it stands for isolation of sound so let us try and understand how this products can help us in achieving some more better sound experience and at the same time let us evaluate how they work in the indian scenarios now before we begin let us understand what exactly is iso acoustics and what are their products which can actually help you and i get better sound experience now iso acoustics as the name says it stands for isolation and acoustics put together now isolation in sound is where we do not want the sound to leak too much and acoustics is to improvise the sound performance and that is exactly this canadian brand iso acoustics aims to deliver now they have got some specialized products these products can be a combination of stands on which you can keep your speakers they have got feet as well where you can keep your subwoofers or even floor standing speakers and the third product is again some exclusive gear to isolate the component which can be turntable which can be any other av component as well now the purpose of all of these products is to reduce the vibrations that can be passed on to the floor that they are kept on or to the surface that they are kept on and these products are right now been used by a lot of hi-fi stereo enthusiast who want to achieve finesse in that sound second one is the music producers who are very very careful about the sound output and thirdly people who have got problems with the subwoofers or the floor standing speakers where the bass is actually causing disturbance in the vicinity now let us understand that where all these products can fit in in our indian environment now in our indian environment we have got floors which are made either out of marble granite tile or wooden flooring and in certain cases where there is a home theater we use a carpet now these are the common four to five types of flooring that you and i have in our homes right apart from that the speakers that we are currently keeping uh, we are keeping them on the shelf for instance the floor standing or the bookshelf speakers we are either keeping them on the shelf or we are keeping them directly on the floor if you see the floor standing speakers some of them have already got their stands or plinth where they ask you to use those plinths which are coming with the spikes to elevate the sound experience and to give some room between the speaker and the surface but this can work well for the people who have floor standing speakers now to those of you who have got floor standing speakers but do not have any bass unit or to the people who have got bookshelf speakers which are kept on the shelf below the tv the problem is the entire surface of your speaker at the bottom is in contact with the shelf and when that happens the resonance the vibrations of the speakers are passed on to that floor because sound is nothing but an energy and this energy is getting passed on to the surface that it is connected to now these energy can come out in the form of unwanted vibrations which can damage or which can hamper your listening experience and that is where these products can come in which are specialized with their rubber now the rubber is one of the best way to isolate sound and they have got exactly that covered apart from that if you are keeping the speakers at lower height and you want to elevate the angle of their performance iso acoustics have again got you covered now in front of me i have got three products the first one is the aperta 300 now aperta 300 on the right hand side which is here is actually used for center speaker now most of the times when you keep a speaker inside a cabinet at a lower height and you are sitting at a ear level of 40 inches the speaker sound is actually more in the area of floor so if you want to elevate that sound you can simply use these speakers you can extend their 
heights in the front. So that way, when you use the speakers, you can actually get a tilted performance. Now, by doing this, you are able to elevate the center channel vocal and you are now able to enjoy the same sound in a better format. Now, this is about the Appleta 300, which is for the center speaker. On my left is the stand which is meant for a bookshelf speaker. Now, there are two models in this one which is just Appleta, and the second model is the Appleta 200. Appleta 100 or Appleta and Appleta 200 are made for bookshelf speakers with various weight capacities. Now, based upon the weight capacity, you can select either of these two models and bring them home to get it connected with your bookshelf pairs. And with the same theory of angle based orientations, also taking care of the vibrations, these stands can be worthwhile to use with your bookshelf speakers, especially to improve the sound performance. And the last product that I have is this ISO acoustic sub, which has again has two models the sub model and the sub XL model. It is purely dependent upon the weight of the subwoofer, which model to go for. Now this sub model can take care of a weight of 30 kgs, I think for the subwoofer, which is far more crazy to have in our home theater room. Now the benefit of this is that it elevates the subwoofer from the floor and you have now got only certain points where the concentration or where the surface will meet the subwoofer. Now, since it's a rubber pad, all of these products are made of rubber. So rubbers are going to act like good dampeners. And in case you want to put them on the carpet, then especially for these stands, you get these discs, which are the plastic discs, but it has got spikes. So these can ensure that your subwoofer doesn't move from the surface, even while keeping them on the fabric. Now, these three products are one of their entry level series but one of the best investments that you can have in your home theater now let us see what difference these stands make in the real world performance starting with the bookshelf speakers Now, while doing the subwoofer testing, we realized that without the isoacoustics feet in place, the subwoofer is actually causing a lot of vibrations on the floor or the surface that it has been kept on. But the moment we added this, we realized that the punch now has become much more better and much more powerful in delivery because the energies are well consumed and well directed to the place where it has to hit the most. Now in each of this test, what we observed is that the bass tightening is very, very high. For instance, you have got less boominess when we use the speakers and we could get more control on the speakers as well as on the subwoofer. The clarity of the sound was also far more better. Since the cabinet resonance is now reduced, it has given the vocals and the mid sound very, very clean response. Now while most of you will find application with these products, there are certain times where these stands or these products may not come in handy for you. The first instance of that is when you are using the stands in already a floated floor. 
A floated floor is actually a suspended floor which does not have any support at the bottom. So by default, the contact to the surface is, is already less in that. In such cases, these stands may not bring any value to you. The second instance is when your speakers are in wall or satellite. So any in wall, on wall or satellite speakers will not have good response with these products. But guess what? When you put your in wall, on wall or satellite speakers, most of the times the company provides you with a small rubber jacket which they give you to make sure that you put it behind the speaker and the touch of that speakers with the surfaces is also pretty much controlled. So go check that out. And the third instance when this will not work for you is when by default the product's positioning calibration is not done right. So irrespective of the floor surface, these stands can actually perform magic to your sound setup when used properly. And this magic is actually backed by science. So let me know your thoughts on ISO acoustics and their products in the comments below. And if you have used them in the past, feel free to share your experience as well. That's it from my end. I Tanmay Mehta, your home cinema consultant or home theater. We'll see you again in my next video. Thank you so much.